Hello, my name is Yves Mora from the National Library of Luxembourg and I will present to you CDX Summarize. What is this? Well, it's a tool that was developed in the WorkNet research program. We wanted to know more about national collections and national webs. And especially in Europe, there are many web archives which are not accessible through the internet and there is little to no information on overlap between closed archives and the open archives like Internet Archive or Chrome, Common Crawl. They often only have statistics about uh, how many petabytes are in the archive and um, the work and the CDX files are too big for researchers to handle. And plus there are legal issues for sharing about privacy, copyright and so on. So we need a different data format that is a sort of lowest com common denominator that is accessible from all in uh, archives but that is still rich enough to do research on. Here's an example of the CDX summary file that's uh, generated by the program. So you have the domain in green, uh, you have per year uh, the number of files and the sizes of the files according uh, to different MIME types. So you have HTML, image, video, audio, PDF, uh, and so on and so on. And what can you do with this data? Well, here's an example where I compare Internet Archive and Common Crawl holdings for the French top-level domain. And I can see that um, in the Internet Archive, the domains are harvested with a d deeper depth. So the there's more data per domain. Here's another example where I um, compare the holdings for Internet Archive, Common Crawl, and the Luxembourg Web Archive for .lu. Uh, you can see very clearly on the orange bar on the right from 2016 onwards, the Luxembourg uh, Web Archive has done broad crawls, and before we don't have much data. But you can also clearly see that um, the overlap between Common Crawl and inter Internet Archive is uh, not so big. So where do I get the data from? Well, the program runs on CDX files or CDXJ files uh, and can also be run through the uh, solar indexes that are created from the work indexer. And uh, thank you, Toki, for your help on this one.